This program is brought to you through the support of the following sponsors. A very pleasant day, friends, and welcome to another edition of Auto Review. Ito po si Ron De Los Reyes, greeting you from the beautiful Rancho Bernardo here in Bagac, Bataan. And we're here for the media ride and drive featuring the all-new Mitsubishi Triton. This is the newest pickup from Mitsubishi Motors Philippines Corporation. And uh, you see here uh, the two units we started in uh, Paranaque City near uh, Mall of Asia and then drove to the Skyway and then Enlex and then we stopped in uh, San Fernando Pampanga uh, at uh, Lola North uh, restaurant uh, where we had our lunch and then from there we uh, made our way to the Esitex and then exited uh, on Dinalupihan and uh, from Dinalupihan we drove maybe another 20 minutes going to Pilar in Bataan. We went straight to our activity for the day, off-road driving in Bagak, Bataan. Of course, we concluded the day driving here at this exclusive resort in Bagak, Bataan. Today we have another media ride and drive, this time from Mitsubishi Motors Philippines Corporation. And uh, what we have here are several units of uh, the new Mitsubishi Triton. Some of the trucks have the roof tents like uh, this one over here. And uh, this is really made for adventure. With this uh, vehicle, you can go beyond limits. We actually came from uh, Paranaque City and then we drove to the Skyway and then Enlex. And the Triton displayed uh, very good uh, torque, especially on those long stretches on the highway. The weather is cooperating, no rains yet. <laughs> and uh, many of us are trying the off-road uh, track. The vehicle over here are really meant uh, for adventure, for camping, for overland. to take off from uh, Parcal here in Paranaque near uh, Manila Bay of course uh, our driver starting driver is uh, Neil Pagulayan the posi Ron de los Reyes and uh, we are headed to Mexico not uh, Mexico City but in uh, <laughs> Mexico Pampanga for our lunch and then we'll have some off-road driving uh, somewhere in uh, Pampanga this is the Mitsubishi Triton Ride and Drive. New Triton from uh, Mitsubishi. We're driving this uh, along Esitex on our way to Ginalupihan in Bataan, where we will take off uh, to Magak. This is a big improvement from uh, the previous Strada pickup. Although the Strada was a very good uh, truck, but this one has. Uh, a lot of uh, improvements like on the suspension side it's very comfortable and now we're turning to uh, Inalupihan and take uh, along the four San Fernando Highway okay this uh, vehicle is equipped with the uh, navigation system like what we see now and it looks like uh, our friend uh, Neil is very comfortable at the back 
How was it? Uh, it's very good. Uh, spacious, <laughs> lots of headroom, and I've uh, got lots of leg room. It's not that too. taking a different uh, route. Earlier, we took the farm to market road uh, here in Baga, but now we have, uh, this is a different uh, path. We're crossing some uh, mountain roads, unpaid, and uh, we're going up here now. And uh, we have some rocks uh, along the way. Look at the convoy. It's it's beautiful. We have a beautiful view uh, from here, and uh, this explains why the Triton slogan is "Go beyond limits." So this is Bataan. Napakalawak pala ng Bataan talaga. Ang tawag na dito ay Bataan Peninsula. So look at this uh, view, and uh, we're doing off-road right now. We're going farther going beyond limits. Uh, well, we launched that All New Triton last uh, January 2024, and uh, we've been wanting to do this activity for quite some time. Unfortunately, the schedules just wouldn't match, but now we're so thankful to media that uh, we are able to do this. And uh, we, start, we started in uh, Parkal Mall in Pasay. And yesterday we went all the way to Bataan, to Cabo Cabo View Deck, where uh, we were able to do some light off-roading to showcase some of the features and capability of the all-new Triton. And after that, uh, we went here to uh, Rancho Bernardo for the rest of our two-day activity with the media. The objective of this uh, drive is to show off the capabilities and features of the all-new Triton, so both on-road and off-road. So the all-new Mitsubishi Triton is available in a total of seven variants from GL, GLX, and Athlete. And what we have here now is our top-of-the-line two-wheel drive and four-wheel drive variants. The black vehicle behind me is the GLS two-wheel drive automatic. And the orange one is the top-of-the-line. So this is the Athlete four-wheel drive automatic, which is equipped with our uh, new engine, a dual-stage turbo 2.4-liter diesel engine with uh, 204 PS and 470 newton meters of torque. Now let's do a short walk around of this new offering from uh, Mitsubishi Motors Philippines Corporation. It uh, really looks uh, impressive, it looks sporty. I also like the wider uh, tires. And of course, the step board. This is almost a slip, slip free. When you get into it, it, it gives you that uh, kind of attraction, especially when you're wearing uh, rubber shoes. You have here the pickup bed. And the walls are made uh, higher because of uh, this accessory, which is original. It's also ideal for camping <laughs> because you can have uh, a, uh, some kind of a uh, sleeping platform and then you make uh, some extension here and you can lie flat on this bed. All right, this is the top of the line uh, Mitsubishi Triton. It's called the Triton Athlete. Uh, you have beautiful interiors. Uh, look at the, the combination of uh, the seats. The, these are very comfortable seats and uh, you have the feeling that you're being hugged at the back so it uh, adds to the stability of, uh, of uh, the driver and also the other occupants of the vehicle. Uh, very sporty steering wheel, you have the controls right at your fingertips and then you have this uh, wide video monitor so when you go on uh, parking maneuver 
It gives you a 360 degree view of the surroundings. Yung pagpasok dito sa likod, napakadali, no? And aided by this handle, which is very sturdy. And you have that uh, very good uh, step board. And you have a good uh, legroom. That was my position earlier as a driver. And now, as a rear passenger, maluwag pa rin po. Maluwag. Ganda ng headroom. I think what attracts you most in uh, the interior would be the color combination of uh, the leather seats. Very nice. Very pleasing to the eyes and very comfortable. Now, if you enjoyed uh, listening or watching this uh, review of the Triton, we'd like to invite you to uh, like and subscribe our YouTube channel, Auto Review Philippines. And uh, we have a lot of other uh, car reviews in, in that uh, channel, Auto Review Philippines. Please subscribe. Tell your friends about it. Auto Review is now celebrating its 30th year on the air. And uh, we started back in May. 1994 we have a lot of uh, other things in store for you on the youtube uh, channel Isuzu San Pablo Gent Cars Incorporated has proudly inaugurated its new state-of-the-art dealership in San Pablo City. The grand opening event led by Chairman Edgar Cabangon marks the unveiling of the largest Isuzu showroom to date. The event coincides with the 23rd anniversary of Isuzu Gen Cars. IPC President Tetsuya Fujita congratulated Isuzu San Pablo. We are here right now at this opening of the new Isuzu San Pablo iOS dealership. This is new iOS facility is aligned with the new Isuzu outlet standard, promoting utmost customer satisfaction with its spacious showroom display and transaction area. Plus, it's extensive service shop that can cater from our light commercial vehicle pickup and SUV to our heavy duty trucks. The new Isuzu San Pablo dealership is designed in accordance with the Isuzu Philippines Corporation's new Isuzu Outlet Standard, or IOS. The new Isuzu San Pablo has a total lot area of 10,000 square meters with more than 8,000 square meters of floor area or utilized area for both the showroom and service shop. The showroom has a total floor area of 753 square meters, which is our biggest showroom to date. It can display of up to seven light commercial vehicles and two commercial vehicles or trucks, with still enough space for customer transaction, lounge, and accessories display. And at the back, the new service shop has a nine service base, which can accommodate from light commercial vehicles up to our heavy-duty truck models, ready to serve the booming business industry here in San Pablo City, Laguna. To all the viewers 
residents, uh, especially those residing in San Pablo area, we invite you to come and visit this new IOS dealership located at kilometer 85 Mahardika Highway, Barangay San Ignacio, San Pablo City and inquire about our latest product, discounts and promotions. We will be very happy to assist you. With the launch of the new Isuzu San Pablo dealership, IPC is confident that it will strengthen its presence in the region, securing its number one position in the truck market and boosting sales in the light commercial vehicle segment. Mitsubishi Motors Philippines Corporation has finally launched the Mitsubishi X-Force in the local market, making it the newest crossover to enter the cutthroat BSUV segment. Hey, 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 hey. Newly minted MMPC President Ritsu Amaida is bullish that the vehicle would be able to penetrate the market. In a press conference with the media right after the launch ceremony held in the grand ballroom of Shangri-La, the fort in Bonifacio Global City in Taguig, he said that they're targeting to sell about 7,000 units of the vehicle within the company's fiscal year or until March of 2025. So this is uh, what we think is a perfect uh, compact SUV that we were missing from our lineup. And now I'm very much pleased and very confident to introduce this, this perfect bottle, which has all the characteristics for our customers to feel the comfort and the, also the excitement and also the better experiment. This compact SUV, or otherwise I, I would say like small SUV segment, this is actually a growing segment in the past few years. We were preparing this kind of product uh, through the past years, and we are very much confident that this uh, market is further going to grow with having a smaller family size and those gener generations I feel this product is gonna has a smash hit. The five door crossover is beautifully designed. From the front to the rear is a spirited design layout. <laughs> Inside, the expander-inspired cabin is crafted for comfort and convenience. It's highlighted by Segment First Nano X air filtration system and the Yamaha Premium sound system. Performance-wise, it's packed with a 1.5-liter four-cylinder engine paired with a CVT. This is highlighted by a segment leading active yoga control, which is drive modes, such as normal, wet, drive, and mud. It likewise features an unprecedented gauge for driver behavior, along with a G-meter monitor and many others. The vehicle comes in two variants, the GLS and the GT. Priced respectively at 1.367 million pesos and 1.581 million pesos.
that's our show for today. I hope you enjoyed it. And we would like to thank Mitsubishi Motors Philippines Corporation for inviting us to join this media ride and drive featuring the new Mitsubishi Triton. Ito po si Ron De Los Reyes mula dito sa Bagak, Bataan, saying thank you for joining us. Drive safely all the time. We'll see you next week. Maraming salamat po.